Hello everyone, please welcome and join me Easy Steps Cooking. Please click on the bell icon. You will get all the notification of my new videos and let's get started. Very tasty, delicious, crunchy caramel popcorn chicken. Very juicy, very delicious. Please try it. I'm going to share with you how to make it delicious caramel popcorn chicken. The ingredients we need, boneless, skinless, two chicken breasts cut into small bite-sized pieces, two eggs, Kashmiri milk, black pepper and salt, half teaspoon each, one tablespoon cornstarch, then the coating will be all-purpose flour. So let's start marinating the chicken first. Break open the eggs, black pepper, deggy milk. With the help of whisk, we're going to beat it well. Once nicely beaten, add one tablespoon cornstarch. With the help of whisk, combine it well. Once it's nicely combined, there is no lumps, add chicken. Mix it well. Once it's nicely combined, set it aside 10 minutes, then we're going to do the coating with all-purpose flour. We wait it for 10 minutes, mix it one more time. And now, I'll bring all-purpose flour. Take out the chicken pieces and place it in all-purpose flour. Just keep putting all the pieces. Once we added the chicken into all-purpose flour, then we're going to coat it. We're going to make sure that each piece is nicely coated and they're not sticking together. If they're sticking together, just break them open. Now we'll take this one to our gas and we're going to deep fry it. Oil is heated up. The chicken is ready. Grab each piece, shake the extra flour, then we're going to deep fry this. Once the chicken is fried, we have a tray up here. We're going to place it. it will, if there is any oil, it will drain out. Then I have a strain out of it. So let's start putting in. So place it in. So keep adding, fry this in two batches, the cry is pretty big, we're going to add more chicken. So we added half of it and half is still here and within two batches it will be all done. So we're going to make sure that we're going to fry it really well. I'll turn the pan on. And if you look at right now, this is very nice and crunchy. We're going to make sure that it's nice. We change the color like a golden brown, then we're going to pull out. Just flip them over like this. So the top portion goes on the bottom and the bottom comes on the top. As you see, it's a nice clean changing color, the golden brown. So the tip is uh, make it smaller pieces and they cook faster. All the chicken pieces are nicely done. Very crunchy and beautiful texture. So I'm going to pull these out and we're going to prepare the second batch. One tip I want to share with you when we take the chicken out and we'll look at this. The crunchy noise. 
give it like 30 seconds so the oil can heat up. So as the oil heat up again, we're going to start putting the second batch. As you see, it's very crunchy, and that's the last batch we are taking out. And on this side, I'm going to have another kurai, start the burner, one cup brown sugar, and quarter cup water. This is going to be our caramel coating. We're going to cook it. As you can see, the second batch is done. So we're going to pull these out. This is going to be a really nice coating, as you can see. One thread. Now I'm going to bring the gas to low. Caramel coating is all ready. If you take a look, this is what we need. And now we're going to bring the chicken. This is the popcorn chicken. And now we're going to mix it well. Now we can bring the gas on high and keep mixing. This is one of the delicious Caramel popcorn chicken. Wow, so delicious. The dish is all ready and I'm going to turn off the gas and I will dish out. Look at this. Very delicious. Caramel coated popcorn chicken. If you like sweet food, this is one of the best appetizer. Once it's going to be cooled down, then it's going to get very crispy. Let me share with you. Caramel popcorn chicken. If you haven't tried it, please try it and you're going to like it. It's very tasty, juicy, tender and very delicious. You've seen it. It does not take that long to cook it. Please try it and share your comment below. How it turned out for you, like always, like, share, and subscribe, Easy Steps Cooking. Thank you, and have a good day. Bye-bye.